This week's topic about time is really interesting. I was reading the Carnegie Unit article and where that comes from, and it's really interesting because that was how we could standardize the quantification of how well schools were doing, how well attended were they. And so you were basically given a grade based on, you know, how much you were able to do within the time allotted. And so the the movement for reform has kind of happened where we just really want to give students every opportunity to master a topic, that it's not important when they do it, it's just that they need to have as much opportunity to get where they need to. And this idea of competency-based grading really requires technology. They need an ability to publish what they're doing and to explain what they're doing in an efficient way. And so what this means for teachers is that teachers are going to have to become more comfortable with technology because they just will not be able to accomplish all that they need to without it. And so having digital portfolios, having learning management systems like Canvas, um, using something like Google Classroom where you can collaborate and go back and forth with revisions and notes. There are things that are available now that were previously impossible. And so what competency-based, standards-based grading, which is one thing our district is doing, really demands that we just have more tools. We have to have access to those tools and we have to know how to use them. And so what I appreciate about this idea that students move at their own pace means they need to have access, which means we need to know how to build the structure that gives them access. And so I appreciate that technology does that, and I think it's a big challenge for teachers to rise to the occasion, and they're just going to have to know more about how to use those tools. And So good topic this week.